to the ignition and step on the gas. What a bond, guys! Welcome back to another Let's Go JA Tours. And today we're going to be taking a trip onto Russell Heights, going into Cherry Garden. On this tour, we're going to see one of the former homes of one of our national heroes, that's Sir George William Garden. We're also going to see a secret school, that is uh, the Hillel Academy, a private school for the wealthy. Let's see all the developments in this community. Now don't forget to like and comment and if you're new to this channel, subscribe to see more tours of the beautiful country of Jamaica. Now relax, drink a red stripe and enjoy the ride. So we're currently going up Russell Heights. some new apartments to the right hand side of us there they're recently built um, in fact there's a lot of apartments on this main road of Russell Heights right here another one to the right you can see that is uh, being built not uh, fully completed as yet see some nice homes there on your right hand side and we're coming up shortly to the Cherry Garden Great House. So we're now on Great House Road and then we'll be taking a right turn shortly onto Coral Close. Now if you take a look to your left hand side, I'm going to try and see if I can tilt the camera a little bit. You can see this big white house there and this is uh, the former home of uh, Sir George William Garden, one of our national heroes. 
and if you look to your left hand side you can see some nice wonderful homes and uh, on both sides actually um, as I said we are actually in the wealthier neighborhoods or the wealthier residential neighborhoods here in Kingston Jamaica way and we're going to be taking uh, going back onto the uh, great house road or the main road of Russell Heights area right here a second look to your right hand side of the great house that's a chair garden great house unlike most of the other great houses this one is not on a tour you cannot tour it um, unlike Devon house uh, the great house in Devon house and other areas Take the right turn on to uh, do believe it's called Upper Carmel Avenue uh, here. thing I noticed with these homes here um, you have a lot of land space um, again expecting um, when you're in these uh, uh, type of neighborhoods
now we're just going to take a turn back uh, so we're going to turn left onto Carmel Way um, if we continue the street we'll be going up to Upper Carmel Avenue uh, which will actually lead us onto Sunset Avenue um, but we're going to turn back because um, we want to be going towards Hillel um, shortly and you can see some nice homes right here with a uh, open garage or porch area um, for your vehicles so we're now going to be heading back down upper carmel avenue and then we're going to be taking the right turn onto Melwood Way onto Upper Melwood Avenue. So we're now turning on to Upper Melwood Avenue from Melwood Way and we'll be heading up until we reach uh, Upper Mark Way. That house to the left there almost looks like a castle. It seems empty to me so if you have the money and you want to live in a castle or a house that looks like a castle, maybe you can buy it. Somebody was mentioning why is there so much potholes in all these upper communities and I'm telling them that uh, um, in Jamaica it doesn't matter if you're rich or poor there's going to be potholes on the roads um, it's a sad uh, state but you know, both uptown and downtown um, the roads are, are in bad conditions some worse um, but uh, it's not the smoothest ride
now going to be taking the right turn onto Upper Mark Way, and this will take us all the way into Hillel. Uh, I really like this house in front of us. Um, I wish uh, you could see it looks very modern the way how it's built. Um, the uh, camera doesn't capture it well right here. And now if you take a look to our left hand side, this is the Hillel Academy and this is the largest international school in Jamaica which was actually founded in 1969 and uh, as I said it's an international school I um, normally have around maybe 700 students um, from 40 different nationalities and as I said it's for the wealthy um, school fees are very very expensive uh, as you would expect it's even in a wealthy community um, so do no doubt it's going to be expensive and if you want to get an idea of what the school fees are um, for the Jamaican students for the prep school and that's from K1 all the way up to 6th grade it's roughly um, from K1 224 hundred Jamaican dollars so that's two hundred and twenty four thousand Jamaican dollars and that's from the basic school and then at the grade six you'll pay three hundred and twenty thousand Jamaican dollars and for the international students uh, they are roughly like three thousand US dollar going up all the way um, for the high school uh, which is basically five thousand US dollars per term so as I said, the wealth, and this is just in high school. to Russell Heights Road and uh, we are now coming to the end of our tour guys so this is just a part of chair guard means there's a whole other side um, so definitely I will bring, I'll be bringing you back uh, for part 2 so thank you guys for watching and don't forget to like comment and subscribe and uh, keep safe until we link up again on another let's go JA tours